Hola chicos, ¿cómo están? El día de hoy de aquí en Chigalui. Vamos a jugar eh, Más Effect, chicos. Andrómeda. Que me encanta, así que bueno. Eh, en el episodio anterior. Quedamos que nos pasamos todo el episodio prácticamente eh, hablando con el resto de gente. Y yo haciéndole cariño a Ivy. Eh, pero era parte también de lo que teníamos que hacer. Así que no, es, no, es, no fue pérdida de tiempo, por decirlo de alguna forma. Creo que... No sé qué chucha está faltando, bueno, pero hay algo que está faltando. Fíjense que aún me sale como que hay algo. Y... Y acá también, ah, acá es, ok, aquí es armadura, tengo algo nuevo, eh, no, me, o sea, detesto cuando, cuando me sobra como algo así, ya bueno, entonces ya hablamos con él 100% y ahora la pregunta es, tenemos todo esto para acá, qué es lo que vamos a hacer, obviamente. Eh, antes de seguir e eh, ir a hablar con el comandante que realmente él nos va a dar la misión porque ya saben que él nos va a dar la misión o sea, nosotros estamos aquí hueveando y dando vueltas para conocer un poco qué mierda pasa acá ¿no? un humanoide veamos ¿qué ves? It'd be a lot easier if I weren't missing half my stock. Ouch. Why am I paying for these? Half the supplies are inaccessible, what with how we crash landed and all. And I have to trade with the crooks out there for the rest, so. Tan cari carísimo los precios. Eh, mis objetos. Sus objetos. Eh, así que soy pobre, así que no voy a. <laughs> no voy a meterme con él. Un estafador, un estafador. Eh, eh, puedo entender que no tienen recursos y todo el tema, ¿no? Pero tampoco pueden excederse con los precios. Es una, una barbaridad. Pero no voy a leer nada de eso porque no me interesa. Pero sí quiero hablar con él y ver qué me dice. O ella. Oh my, So it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband, he's locked up and slated for exile for a crime he didn't commit. A ver. ¿Cuál fue el delito? Partamos por eso. What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda. But the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Nilkin Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him. Please. Por supuesto, amigo. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. I'm sure the jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Milken I love him. Les diré que lo amas, amiga mía. Bueno, eh, obviamente igual no soy tan mala persona. Eh. Veamos. I know that look. The others bent your ear, did they? Something like that? You get used to it. Just focus on being a Pathfinder. Can't argue with results. Though they'll try. Anyway, welcome to Militia HQ. Excuse the mess. This office fields militia work, Nexus security, and looking for the Turian Ark. What's the word on the Turian Ark? Scattered readings. Some indicate the Natanus was destroyed, others that people are alive. Who knows? If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. Vamos, venid Andromeda. What brought you out here to Andromeda? I was tired of being the good one. The good one? The Kandros family is old military. There were expectations, you know. 
Then my sister became a sculptor, and cousin Nyrene went pirate on Omega. Everyone was proud that I stayed in service. But I kept wondering, when do I get my adventure? Jen Garson's dream was so grand, so gutsy, I had to be part of it. To Babel. You talk like you weren't part of the leadership. How did you end up commanding the militia? I was escorting a prospecting team on some moon when those Ket found us. They penned us like cattle for experiments. I managed to get loose, snatched a gun, and freed the others. By the time we killed the bastards and headed back to war in the Nexus, everyone looked at me like I was in charge. That sounds familiar. The militia grew from there. Funny, once the heat is on, all kinds of people rise to the top. Bienestar Turiano. Are the other Turians managing okay? So-so. We're not good at sitting around in a crisis. Service before self gets drummed into us at boot camp. That's probably why so many of us are in the militia. We like to earn our citizenship, whatever galaxy we're in. Probablemente a ustedes chicos no les aburre esto, pero para mí sí es importante saber aunque sea algo. What do you know about the enemies we've encountered? The Ket. We usually see them on worlds with those alien structures. The Ket don't take kindly to anyone studying them. Not sure why. They don't talk to us. Every time we cross paths, there's a fight or they take prisoners. Why? What do they want? No one knows. But I've seen their weaponry and what they do to those prisoners. I want them a long, long way from the Nexus. It's rough out there. I might need backup, if you can spare the people. I have strike teams specializing in assault and extraction. If you need serious firepower, my Apex teams have you covered. But that isn't news to you, right? Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Me está... O sea, por lo menos me está como dando, eh, o me está diciendo en pocas palabras que... Viste, los, los equipos de asalto de la milicia realizan operaciones peligrosas para todo el, el columno. Habla con Candro para que te autorice a participar, imagínense. Ellos tienen equipos de asalto, eso es muy interesante. ¿eh? Yo quiero hablar con él, así que vamos a entrar. Help you. Pathfinder Rider, here to see Nilkan Rensis. Ah, our murderer. Wife's here all the time. Guess she told you her sob story. Nilkan, you're moving up in the world. There's a Pathfinder wanting to chat with you. Hmm. The Pathfinder, huh? They called in the big guns to exile Andromeda's first murderer. I'm not here to exile you. Told your wife I'd look into things. At this point, it's too late. They found me guilty. Why don't you tell me what happened? I was part of the futile effort to set up a colony on Eos. We were on our last legs, overrun by hostiles, our leader dead. The security chief, Reynolds, my friend, he refused to call for evacuation. I argued with him. Everyone saw. Hmm. So when he was killed, people assumed you did it? For good reason. He ordered us to regroup and counterattack. We were moving through a sandstorm. I saw movement, thought it was the cat, and I I guess I panicked and fired. A witness saw the chief's chest explode. Sounds like an accident. That's what I told them. But I was enraged when we argued. There's a recording. It's, it's ugly. Everyone's certain I did it on purpose so we could evacuate. Only my word otherwise. I'll check out the evidence. Maybe something doesn't add up. It would be nice to have someone with an open mind looking at it. You're a pathfinder. I'm sure Kandros would give you access. Maybe there's still hope. Entonces habla con Kandro y Kandro es eh... Candro, Candro, Candro. La verdad que últimamente acá está Candro. That's the console for our strike teams. What are they? Assault and extraction squads. When we need the best, I have Apex, combat experts who've signed up to defend us. Since you have a front row view of the cluster, I can give you authority to dispatch them.
What situations should they handle? Protecting civilian outposts, holding key positions, or just distracting the cat. Authorization complete. Good luck out there. Hmm. Okay. No news on the Turian Ark yet. Or is this militia business? I spoke with Nilkin Rensis, the man found guilty of the murder on Eos. Yes, our first murder here in Andromeda. I wish it had been our last. When the colony attempts failed, it didn't help spirits that a high-ranking officer was killed by one of our own. Mutiny here on Nexus was probably inevitable, but this acted as a spark. So there was a trial, and he was found guilty? It was short and decisive. Despite the lack of physical evidence, everything added up. His only defense was, trust me, I didn't mean to do it. That is the difference between murder and accidental death. In this case, motive plus opportunity plus eyewitness account equals murder. Look, knock yourself out. A key witness, Cassidy Shaw, works in operations. Go ahead and talk to her. And there's a recording of the perpetrator threatening the victim. I'll let you queue it up on the console there. As far as I'm concerned, this case is closed. Then let's get in there. Bye, Andrews. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. No le quieren dar, eh, reproduce la grabación y habla con testigos so. No le quieren dar una oportunidad, la verdad. The Nexus vs. Colonist Nilkin, Evidence 7A. Hiram! Hiram! They've seized the compound! Call for evacuation! We're not giving up, Nilkin. We're taking it back. No! I'm not letting your ego get us killed! Even if I have to... <coughs> Se escuchó una pequeña como discusión. Él quiso como un poco le dio una orden y él no quiso cumplirla porque simplemente en cierto modo quiso. Eh, no rendirse, por decirlo de alguna forma. Eso es interesante. La piscina es de asalto. Eh, Entonces está todo completo. Entonces le vamos a dar. Eh, quiero hablar con el testigo yo. Y después quiero ir a, a probar esas, esas jugadas de asalto. Eh, voy a un poco evitar las misiones principales por ahora. Entonces. Solamente quiero como un poco. But the planet was toxic. What if they store oxygen in porous tissue? You must be the Pathfinder. Wonderful. You and your Sam are exactly what we need. Thanks, Mr. Professor Herrick. My colleagues and I will work with your Sam and the data you gather to solve Andromeda's scientific mysteries. What fields do you study? Herrick's in the life sciences. I do planetary geology, oceanography, rocks and runoff. Aradana's the space and math ways. Not that we've had much to study, with everyone cooped up for 14 months. But your data on the Scourge flows like poetry. Now we can better advise on repairing the damage it caused. And maybe Addison will give us a real workspace. Who can think with all this racket? Mm. No sé. No quiero pegarme la charla de la Those vida. Those bioscans are superb. Could you gather more for our comparative conservation effort? What conservation effort? Ah, my thesis is on the console there. Broad strokes, we're comparing and preserving organisms from both galaxies. If you donate more bioscans and samples to the catalog, I can get you a finder's fee. 
tempted. Se me está dando un par de que de lo que analizo. Pathfinder, we've had some trouble. Anything I can help with? Perhaps. I discharged an away team to get readings from a section of the scourge that was behaving anomalously. They haven't reported in for some time, and sensors can't locate their shuttle. I sent them out there. Good, dedicated people. I fear what might have happened to them. Your work is important. Don't lose sight of that. When I'm out there, I'll see if I can find them. Their friends and family will want to know what's happened. And I... I need to know. Entonces, eh, ahí hay otra misión de por medio. Eh, habla con el director de no sé qué. Primer golpe, que eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Eh, busca la nave científica desaparecida. Busca la nave científica desaparecida. La miasma. Ok, bueno, aquí... Ciertamente... Hay mucha información de por medio, en serio. O sea, la miasma. O sea, mira, cada vez, cada vez encontramos... Eh, por decirlo así cada vez más cosas o más más información. Hi Pathfinder. Want to hit some rocks for science? Absolutely. What do you need? Sam and I used your scans and made a VI for geophysics surveys. Beta builds on the console there. Test it out in the field and I'll wrangle you a consultant's bonus from Director Addison. How's that sound? Entonces Ah, pero esos son, son minerales, o sea, eso por ahora no, no tiene sentido eh, alguno. Ah, ok. Se fuera también. Tal vez me voy a centrar en esto. Eh, lo que pasa es que, claro, si me centro, o sea, si quiero llegar a algo, porque ya saben que... Tal vez... Eh, ya bueno miren voy a primero voy a quiero tengo tengo un dilema ahí grave de misiones que tengo que hacer Me dice, busca la nave del científico desaparecido. Después tengo que hablar con Sean, que es como el tipo este que sabe o que tiene pruebas. Eh, escanea, que eso va a ser después. Everyone was trained and armed for Frontier. We know Ket are dangerous, and now we have to worry about our people too. No idea where they went, but they left mad. There's apparently no viable planets in range. Exile may have been a sanitized death sentence. What a shit show. 
Pathfinder, we have to get this back on track or we don't survive. No pressure, right? As long as the Nexus is here, as long as we're here, we have a job to do. Double down crisis mode. I can do that. We can do that. Ready and willing, Pathfinder. Entonces, bueno, eso está bien. Ahora Sean, yo no sé quién chucha es, porque no sé. Y me están pidiendo también que haga una misión de asalto. Entonces, tal vez podría meterme en una misión de asalto. Ya, ok. Las misiones de asalto son... Las vamos a sacar del mapa porque la verdad que... <coughs> eh... No me las buscan, busca la nave científica, o sea, si se dan cuenta, las tres son las tareas adicionales. Y escanear la, la fauna, que es una cosa, es lo mismo, habla con Tan, escanea el mineral que se fuera y busca la nave científica desaparecida. Entonces, escanea eso, escanea, habla con Tan, yo creo que por ahora... Y John no sé dónde chucha quedó, porque John supuestamente era, era el tipo este que tenía como un poco más de información. Yo, yo quiero liberarlo, la verdad que esa conversación no me no me llega... Sí, se pudieron haber peleado, todo lo que ustedes quieran, pero no creo que eso haya sido... No, eso no quiere decir de que lo mató. Cassidy Shaw, I'm Scott Ryder. I'm looking into the Nilkin murder case. Oh, man, I thought that was over with. Have you heard the audio recording of their fight? Yes. I helped pull him off Chief Reynolds. You can see it in his eyes. He was gonna kill him. Then in the sandstorm, I had a pretty clear view of the chief. He looked right at me and shouted him out. Then his chest burst open. I'll never forget it. The look on his face was pure shock. Reynolds was leading you back to retake the compound. Did you agree with that? It wasn't my place to agree or disagree. He was ranking officer. In retrospect, it is ironic. If he hadn't been killed, we all probably would have died. Did Nilkin seem remorseful? I lost sight of Nilkin in the turmoil. When we found him, he seemed in shock. He couldn't speak. He looked nauseated. Could have been guilt. The reality of the act sinking in. Mm. Did you see any cat in the vicinity? Nilkin said so, but not that I could see. Still, the sandstorm was severe. Visibility wasn't great. If they'd fought and Nilkin threatened to kill him, why was Reynolds surprised? Friends fight, say things they don't mean, maybe even hurt each other. But you don't expect your best friend to shoot you. To me, that's the saddest part. The chief's heart was broken right before it exploded. Mm. I appreciate the information. Of course. It kills me we had to leave him behind. He deserved a proper funeral. So the body was never examined? Important piece of a murder investigation. Can wouldn't allow a mission to go back for him. Said it was too dangerous. Dice que no analizaron el cuerpo. ¿Cómo mierda no analizaron el cuerpo? ¿Eh? ¿Cómo es eso? ¿Están locos? No puede culpar a alguien. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. In Basana. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. Yeah, that's what I want. Good. 
I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director Addison is entitled to her opinion, and mine overrules hers. Does she know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the score is dealt as a serious bluff. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here, Eos. How? Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Yeah, just point me to my ship. Yeah, the the They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. Something wrong? Ryder, please see me and Sam on the Hyperion. Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No, I'm fine. Hmm. Ryder, you have my condolences for your father. I appreciate it. I didn't know him very well, although I understand he played a key role in planning the initiative. I'm sure he'd be concerned that we still have several arcs missing. Any idea where they went? Nothing certain, but tens of thousands of colonists are unaccounted for. It paints the initiative in an unflattering light. Did you have some other business? I'm looking into the Nilk and Rensis murder charge. And? I want to go to Eos and retrieve Chief Reynolds' body. That isn't usually Pathfinder business. First murder in Andromeda, and I'm impartial. Figured you'd want to get it right. Settling an outpost comes first. But I suppose I have no objections. Physical evidence will only bolster the case. The more certain we can be, the better. All right, but let's keep it quiet. I don't want people thinking we're reopening the case. I hope anything you find reaffirms what's been done, but if it sheds a different light, we'll deal with it. We'll send the coordinates of the murder scene. <laughs> Any more information you can give me on the missing arcs? No, and that is the distressing part. The Asari, Turian, and Solarian arcs are completely unaccounted for. If they had the same problems with the Scourge that we did, I fear the worst. Yes, ma'am. Should you find any clues, please investigate. Without the other arcs, the promise of the initiative can never be fulfilled. As director of the initiative, are you in charge around here or what? If the others would allow me, they don't see me as the rightful successor. What's their problem with you? I am not Gian Garson. Our founder was charismatic, eccentric, larger than life. Traits I cannot hope to mimic. She and her inner circle perished in the scourge, some at the hands of the exiles, some never made it out of stasis. I was deputy assistant for revenue management. Then all seven leaders above me died. I was next in line for the role. So, you're an accountant? Don't let that fool you. We are all capable of more than we know. When I was young, I was fascinated by the idea of exploring space. Life had its detours and I went a different direction. Then I heard about the initiative. 
and saw my chance to try the path not taken. While I may not be setting foot on New Worlds, my authority can ensure that you do. Right. Sorry. So how does anything get done? In theory, Kesh handles the Nexus's physical operations, Kandros runs the militia, and Addison manages colonial affairs. I oversee all of it. In practice, we argue, debate, and yell at each other until a decision is made. If we're lucky. It is maddening. Disculpen que lo haga pasar por esta mierda, pero me interesa. What do I need to consider in making a planet viable? Assuming the planet supports life, an outpost is critical. People like a roof over their heads, and you'll want to eliminate any hostile threats. Whether that's the cat or other terrors lurking in Helios, colonists being murdered on sight can be discouraging. Also, scouting and mapping terrain is a priority for any pathfinder. And don't forget forward stations. You'll want those. Mm -hmm. What more can you tell me about the initiative? It represents the greatest migration ever attempted. No one had ventured beyond the Milky Way before. We've all left home in search of freedom, fortune, perhaps a new beginning. We are the bravest souls each species has to offer. I hope the Nexus will serve as the seat of government for us all. Tiene muchas cosas, pero bueno, veamos. Why do you think most people came? There are thousands of reasons, one for every colonist here. What does any pilgrim seek? Usually, happiness, finding the thing that eludes them, the thing to fulfill them. While we cannot promise they will find it, we can facilitate the search. Why do you think most people came? Oh. There are thousands of reasons. While we cannot promise they will find it, we can facilitate the search. What do you know about the early days of the initiative? As most everyone knows, Jean Garson's vision made it happen. She was an entrepreneur on Earth. Wealthy. Young for a human. Garson had the idea for the initiative in the early 2170s, I believe. Many thought leaving the military was possible. Uh, but she persevered. Como and as with most great ideas, the doubters were wrong. It looks like a melting pot around here. The Nexus is home to several initiative species. Many came ahead of the Arcs. The hope is that this station will one day serve as the governing body in Andromeda. Though I'm not sure what they were thinking, lumping Krogan into the mix. As a Solarian, my kind tend to have a low opinion of them. Nothing I've seen here has changed that. Este episodio va a ser un poco más de información y ya luego. It sounds like the Nexus has had a rough time of it. Publicly, I was more than up for the challenge. Privately, I can tell you, it's been a disaster. The scourge killed hundreds, many of them our senior leadership. Even the founder of the initiative, Gian Garson, is dead. Hmm. How did Gian Garson with the rest of the leadership? When the Nexus hit the scourge, a large wing of stasis pods was destroyed. They were killed instantly. These people traveled 600 years and died before they even woke up. Jean Garson never glimpsed Helios. She never saw her vision realized. Kendris mentioned something about hitting the Scourge. How did it play out? Criminal elements took advantage of the emergency and preyed on people's fears. An uprising followed. We had no choice but to turn to the Krogan to deal with them. They crushed the mutiny and the criminals were banished. Exiles, we called them. I doubt we've heard the last of them. They're led by an outlaw, Sloane Kelly. She used to be one of ours. Who is this Sloane Kelly? She was head of security on the Nexus. She opposed the uprising at first, but eventually turned traitor and joined them. Misguided sympathy for the plight of the common citizen? Nonsense. They posed a direct threat to our existence. There don't seem to be many Krogan around. Good riddance. The Krogan demanded a greater say in political matters. The last place you want them involved? Their muscle, nothing more. Good for fighting and lifting heavy objects. When they didn't get what they wanted, they left. Why don't you like the Krogan? It's common knowledge that they are a violent, ignorant species, 
Long ago, they waged nuclear war on one another. Their planet was decimated. My people tried to uplift them, but the Krogan could never tame their worst instincts. What if they bring their tempers to Andromeda? We'll all be dead. Si creen que es mucho, eh, si solo salgan adelante en el, el video, chicos. Porque en este, realmente, este episodio ha sido 100% información, o sea, no... Yasma. Eso fue lo que chocamos en un principio, la miasma. Por eso es, por eso, por eso es interesante tener información de todo, sobre todo en este juego. En este juego es, es un juego que realmente eh, requiere investigación, en mi opinión o en mi punto de vista. Creo que necesitamos realmente investigar bien y saber qué vamos a hacer. Este episodio va a ser eh, larguísimo. Okay. Lo voy a dejar hasta acá. Eh, la verdad, esto va a ser ya lo último. Y yo... Voy por el segundo grado de eso, por lo menos. Tecnología... Yo soy más de combate, así que me voy a ir por esto, que fue lo que dije. Así que nada chicos, eso va a ser por el día de hoy, la verdad. la verdad hay muchas cosas o sea si vemos el diario yo sé que estoy puro hueveando pero eso no lo vamos a hacer la inspección es sexual todo lo mismo habla con Sam busca información sobre las arcas misiones recibidas en la estación social en el centro Investiga la prueba del asesinato, que eso ya lo sabemos. Eh, esto es escanear, escanear y esto busca la nave científica desaparecida en la miasma. Entonces sí hay muchas cosas que hacer. Así que nada chicos, eso va a ser por el día de hoy. Ya saben, suscríbanse, déjenme like, comenten mejor video. Y disculpen si los hice pasar por toda esta conversación, pero es importante saberlo. Así que nada, ya los veo pronto. Cuídense, compartan el canal, hagan clic arriba para que les lleguen las notificaciones. Así que eso, cuídense.